Hey guys, it's your girl Fit Sid, and I am back with another video. If you guys have never been to my channel before, I talk about a lot of different things. I am someone that is in the adult film industry, so like some of my stuff is like behind the scenes, um, talking about that, vlogs, some weight loss and fitness. I have been on YouTube for a hot minute now, so like I have a lot of random life content, but this is all just based upon my life experiences and stuff. And um, I am considered a thicker chick. So if you're curvy like me, this video is perfect for you. If you wanna see what bombshell sportswear looks like on a girl like me, I currently weigh about 226. I am 5'9", uh, I'm a 36, F or a 36 triple D depending on the day with my chest size and then um, pants and all of that I'm a size 16 in jeans so just for reference um, I ordered these I have not tried them on but I will try them on before I keep filming but I just wanted to show you when I ordered they all came in a package like this so I'm gonna open it up and then I'm gonna go try it on and then I'll do my review but there's this one, which I ordered, and I really love purple. I've heard a lot of good things about this brand. Wow, this looks kind of small. Maybe not. I ordered it in a size XL. I really like high-waisted, so I got the thick waistband. And then, I was not expecting this fabric. And then the, yeah, thick waistband, and then the thigh-high sock style. And this is in the size XL. So, yeah. It's the plum color. Then I got this sports bra in a large because they actually didn't have, I don't know for sure if they sell certain things in XL, but like the ones that I liked did not come in XL, so this is a large. As you guys know, I do have a bigger chest, so hopefully this will cover. It looks like it will. There is padding that you can take out, and I probably will take it out just because for me, I don't like to have extra. Um, there's a little hole in the middle, so this is probably going to be a weightlifting bra, not a running bra. And this is just in the size large and neon yellow. And then I got the matching leggings for it. They also have a couple different ones. And these are also in XL, as right now I'm probably the heaviest that I've been in a long time. So I know that a large would be way too small. Um, but we're gonna try it on and see how it actually fits. So it's also in XL and it just looks like this. So. From first glance, it looks like it's good material. It feels different than I expected, but I'm gonna try it on and I'm just gonna see how I feel and I'm going to show you what it looks like tried on and then I will give you guys my review and we're gonna do a bend over test and see if it is squat proof. So this is a fitness apparel brand, so hopefully they are squat proof. I will be wearing um, probably black underwear. That way, like, if it is showing through you can easily see but i never wear any like bright colors to the gym so as long as you can't see if they're black you're good but with that being said i'm gonna go try these on and show you all right so i'm back and now i'm gonna tell you my opinion and i feel like a lot of people are gonna be like sydney you should know when you bought these things but this is my honest real opinion I was not paid, I was not sent any of these products, I bought them with my own money, they are pretty expensive as well, so this is why I decided to make the video because I didn't see that many videos out there on these products and I see ads all the time on Facebook and on Instagram and I've been wanting a pair for so long that I figured, you know what, let's just do it, let's buy myself some. It is also winter, so I wanted something for myself. So, first of all, um, let's go back over my sizing. So I'm going to show you guys me wearing it as I talk about each product. I want to say that I did very well with getting an XL. I wasn't sure because if you guys are wondering what I am in other sizes, XL is definitely the one that fits me. It fits really well. I, in Alphalete, I can wear a large. So if you're looking to compare like different brands, like personally, I feel like this one runs a little smaller but it's just different fabric like I feel like al alphalete fabric is like thicker versus these bombshell ones are like not mesh but they're just a weird meshy like stretchy fabric on the bottom and then a really buttery soft um fabric at the very top so like at this all the way to here and then it becomes like meshy so I'm not sure if you can see what I'm showing you but can you see how that's kind of meshy? 
and it goes there and then it turns into this buttery soft fabric so first of all I do want to say I did pick right on the XL and I'm really glad I did because I was thinking about getting a large and then an extra large in like each color but then I was like no I feel like this is gonna run small I don't think it runs fully small but if you are someone that can wear a large sometimes and you can wear an extra large as well like definitely size to the higher size that you normally wear I wouldn't say size up though if that makes sense because I am a little bit thicker than I normally am so if that explains it but the fabric itself is awesome it's such good quality these are probably the most flattering leggings that I've had in a long time when it comes to my stomach so if you guys don't know like the body that I have is like I have a decent sized chest I have a stomach I have legs like I'm proportionate I'm not like exactly an hourglass but I am an hourglass but I do have a tummy with a pooch and a fupa and like I'm just saying this hides the fupa and I really like the way that the fabric is I feel like it's very versatile I feel like I can wear it to do errands I can wear it to the gym I can wear it to take my dog to the dog park like it's just such a comfy thing to wear so like right now I'm actually wearing it and I really like it um so I would say overall I would actually give these leggings a 10 out of 10 normally I don't do this I think they are definitely worth the money so if I were you though, I would definitely pick the higher size if you're in between sizes and so like like the way I am, like I'm not a large, but I'm not always an extra large and I definitely would say get the extra large. Um, I think it only goes up to XL and I think the sports bras don't even go up to XL. So if I were you, don't get one of the crazy sports bras if you have really big boobs. Like I have decently big chest, right? Probably not the best option to get the one with the hole here because I swear to God, my boobs are natural. They're not fake. Fake ones could probably fit in these and look really awesome if they're big and like they would just sit perfect. Mine are not perky. Mine need to be held up and supported. And this little hole makes it really easy for them to fly away when I'm working out. So if I was going to say get this bra, I would not say get it. Honestly, like Lululemon came out with a bra similar to this. Um, honestly, probably like five years ago at this point, maybe six. And I remember when, like, I liked that one because the hole was a lot smaller. Like, it was just a detail versus this one is, like, your whole boob could just pop out of it. So, if I were you, I would be very careful when it comes to picking a sports bra because they do have them that match. Like, the neon in both of the leggings, it goes really well together. It matches and everything, and I love that. But they have a pink version, and I don't think that I'll be getting the sports bra for it unless they have one that is just a very plain normal sports bra because I like the stuff that looks cute but it's just not practical for me to wear in the gym and also if I'm running around doing errands I don't want to have to worry about what's going to be falling out in places um so for personal preference I would not recommend this sports bra if you have a big chest um and if you have natural breasts because if you have natural ones I promise you they will fly away and even if they're perky they're still like a lot more squishy so they can like move around more and I think that's my biggest concern with it so I would, I would probably honestly give it like a 4 out of 10 and that's just because they don't have an XL and the hole in here is just like not very practical but with the leggings I definitely think they're a 10 out of 10 I love how buttery soft they are I love the material they're very stretchy can you see this is like really good stretch the high waistband of these leggings, which I will link the exact ones down below, is amazing. And I definitely think I'm going to order some more because I just love the way that they fit. I love the way that they feel. Um, do I think they're 100% squat proof? No, I don't. But if you wear nude underwear, they're fine. So I think if you wear like seamless nude underwear, you would be completely fine. Or if you wear a G-string, no one's really going to care. But that is my honest personal opinion um i'm gonna go a little bit more in depth with like each color just so you can see as i talk about it again so you can see what i'm like wearing so as for the sports bra i'm gonna say four out of ten on this i think that the fabric definitely needs to have more so like if they made it in an extra large it probably would fit better if you have natural boobs try not to get the ones where it falls out the bottom um, cool straps are awesome. They have a lot of different things on their site, but um, if you are 36 triple D or higher or even a double D, it probably will not fit you a large. So I would recommend not getting that. Um, 
and some if they end up having extra large would probably fit as for the plum legging i love these i will definitely be wearing these i love the fact that it's white detail because i can just wear a white sports bra and a white top and it's like super easy <sighs> i'm tired but these ones are awesome i will be wearing these and they're just very comfortable they're easy ones to do leg day in or running or anything like that and a lot of the time with my thick thighs one of the main problems i have is just like having it oh, fit to my body and this fabric is perfect as for these ones 10 out of 10 as well i feel really good in these i like these a lot i feel like they're very versatile and colorful um if you're not gonna end up getting a sports bra because you do have a bigger chest like me i would highly recommend maybe just pairing it with like a black sports bra and then like a jacket that way it's like still cute but I really do like these. I think they're really cute. They definitely go down to my ankles. I am 5'9", so if you are shorter and you're, like, thicker, you might have some problem with that. And the fabric is kind of weird to, like, have hemmed. So if you're struggling with that decision, I would maybe say don't do it. But other than that, I really do love these. I definitely want to get some more. And I don't know what I want to get, but for me personally... I feel like these are awesome. I feel like they're really great for my body and my myself and just like the way I live life. And um, if you're willing to splurge on the cost, then I think that they are worth it. But if I were you also and, you're, and you struggle with your um, stomach being a little bit bigger, I would really highly recommend getting the ones that are the thick waistband because the thinner ones are not going to be flattering these ones are going to be high waisted and everything and looking at the pictures like the thin one i know would not look as good on me um than these ones do like the style is just a lot more flattering so if you have a body type similar to mine and you're curious and you're like okay what do i order um and you don't like the stuff that i personally got still try and look for the thick waistband because if you find that it's gonna look better on you than it will with the thinner one um but with that being said i love you guys so much thank you for taking the time out of your day to watch this i hope you enjoyed and if you want more of these um feel free to reach out to me and ask me to review specific brands because like I know that it's really hard to find sport wear and stuff like that and like this is stuff that you could wear anytime all the time and it seems very good quality from my first impression now my one concern is washing them i don't know how they're gonna wash but i'm guessing they'll be fine um but if there's anything that happens I might make it and put it in a vlog. So anyways, that's all for this video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to add me on my Snapchat, like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter. Um, everything will be down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.